Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the Perfect People Podcast. This is OG. This is Ariel, a.k.a. Ari. This is Dee Dee. And this is your girl, Faronda. Hey, y'all. Hey. hey. <laughs> On this episode, we talked about gender roles. And the common thread was partnership. We discussed the presence of a safety net or the lack thereof. And while throwing a little shade, Ariel, a.k.a. Ari, talks about how they handle gender roles in their household. And Faronda asked us about one gender role that is non-negotiable. After this break, let's get to it. This is the Very Necessary Podcast. Come on in, have a seat, and unplug from the world by listening to Jennifer, Vaughn, Yoshi, and Sue. Where you get our unapologetic view on relationships, balance, careers, and how we handle it all, or how we don't. This podcast is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. You can catch us each and every Wednesday on Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Spotify, iHeart, Amazon Music, and anywhere you listen to your favorite podcasts. Oh, look at my book bag sitting nicely on the floor. You said you already started recording. <gasps> Stop, man. We talk about bras in the recording. My and name titties. is Ariel. <laughs> Talking um, about Ms. Orlando, and I wear a. <gasps> Come on, baby. y'all. He's recording for real. Go. Now, because you said. Okay. Um, y'all, so mm. I have been contemplating mm-hmm. um, because I'm getting so young. <laughs> oh, wow. That's y'all exactly what a, you're getting, girl. <laughs> you laughed a little bit too hard. <laughs> you are digressing in age. Mm. Maybe digressing in maturity. But anyway, oh. I digress from the topic. What happened? <laughs> oh, that's a lot of digressing. I don't know. Basically, you old. Anyway. anyway, anyway, anyway. Don't anyway me with your old self. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> so, I have been thinking about how I'm going to... And wait, first of all, that's the wrong way. Because I was about to say how I'm going to run my house. But I can't run the house because I'm supposed to do that submit thing. That's such a bad word for me. Mm. But, um, you know, I was just trying to figure out, like, how would things go? Because I've been single for a long oh, time. Years. <laughs> mm. Long time. 50 years? No, I ain't mm. been here 50 years, bro. Huh? About. But um, I've never been married. Mm-hmm. I have been in several, a few situationships. <laughs> and I've lived with one man. First off, why you had to change from several to few? Because like it made a difference. Right. <laughs> several seem like woo. A few I'm, seem like oh okay. Oh, girl, well. they both seem like the same thing. <laughs> what about a plethora? More than two. Yeah, that's, know, that's, a <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a lot. That's a lot. Plethora. <laughs> I ain't had no plethora of nothing. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, anyway, <laughs> like I'm talking about. <laughs> I'm talking about what I'm talking Can about. Can you hurry up and get to the point? I, I just said it. I was like, you know, how are we going to do things? As far as, like, who is going to do what? Yeah, who's going to do what? How are we going to handle this money? Um, Who going to take out this trash? Oh. So, on. basically, the gender, gender roles of the relationship. Yes, that's what that I was trying mm. to do. So, two people. To coach y'all. So, two people had to break to, down. No, I wanted to coach. That girl you know said she wanted to coach us. <laughs> You're bringing in the topic, but you want to coach us yes, into bringing yes. in the topic. Because I want to see if y'all are paying attention. So, now y'all see why I'm always the one that bringing the topic, right? Mm. 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 She said a lot of words. And it's gender that roles. That's two. I don't even want two. To say that no more. Girl, you did this last week, but you didn't want to say gender that no roles. And we're and saying so. Forget. Forget. Oh, whatever week that was. It might not have been last week. Y'all, these podcasts be running together. But anyway. Mm-hmm. She always be putting herself in time out and take herself out. Oh, yeah, I'm out already. Oh. No. <laughs> wow. That, <was> <laughs> that didn't even last for Okay, so, <clears throat> Landa, what's your ideal, like, when you say gender roles, like, what do I want my husband to do? <laughs> and what I want and what I want to do. That's yeah. when I had said, what's your ideal? <laughs> yeah, that's what that meant. Because, you know, some people might not know what ideal means. But anyway. What? So basically she's saying she didn't know what ideal means. Oh, I know. Oh, but then why First off, why are you insulting our listeners? I was just thinking of one in particular. Oh, Sorry. my gosh. They might not be a listener. Girl, they, go ahead. Okay. For real. Ideal. <laughs> I'm sorry. Get on my nerves. Okay, so I want my man, this is just sad, this is the first thing. I want him to put gas in my car every week. I don't ever want to put 
gas in my car what if ever you need again. It more than once a week? Well, whenever it needs it. Mm. He, it that's his job. Mm. Maintenance, all that stuff. I just want to put the key in the ignition or press the button to start it and drive and not worry about anything. Mm-hmm. Um, I want him to make a lot of money. Mm. I don't want to make all the money because I want it to, you know, I want to be a help mate. I don't want to be a do it all mate. Mm. Mm. Sounds like you're speaking from experience. And I ain't never been married, but I ain't never. I'm talking about speaking from your from experience. plethora of your right. Um, my with few your situationships. <laughs> okay, my so, few. So you got to put gas in your car, <laughs> make the money, uh-huh. and that's but it, not so. all the money because you got to make some money. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Make some so money. he can beat you upside the head. He can step out in the relationship. I mean, no. I, I said it was said that that gas thing was a bit. I hate okay, it. Well, I need but, gas so right you now. won't go on and on and oh, okay. on. Yeah. What is your top five? <laughs> okay. Right. Thank you. Should but she only did two so far, so you might okay. need to say top three. Yeah. I'm the, the way that we was gonna be going. Okay. Because you don't give me no think time. But anyway, uh, that's why I was. You said that you were the one that was thinking about the topic. But, I mean, sh- okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Gas, the money, um, loyalty. Um, communication, but that, those, those are those general, general roles. roles. Like, what That's what I was saying because I forgot okay. what we was doing. That's what I'm saying. Next, get what <laughs> Ariel? So. Oh, no, I'm about to call you. No, 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 no. I want to go finish because oh, then they feel like gosh. I don't even want to talk to them. <laughs> All right, you so. back in time out. Okay, good. <laughs> so Ariel, let's go. All right, so let's see gender roles. I'm, see, I'm supposed to say how well my man doing, right? Yeah. Not how I, or how do I want it? Because um, like it might not be the right way. Let's say what's currently happening first. Okay, okay, all right. Currently happening, he does put gas in my car, and I am so grateful for that because I hate the gas station. Mm -hmm. Um, Now, we fuss a little bit about the trash, (laughs) but, you know, after I say it, maybe twice, he, you know, he start fussing. Then he'll take the trash. Um, Making the money, that part really doesn't uh, matter to me. Cause mm-hmm. we done been through so many situations where one time he was up and then I was down and then I was down and he, you know what I'm saying? Like right. it's been reverse world. So that part really doesn't matter. As long as you're making effort and showing that you're going to commit something, then that's fine. What about um, financial decisions though? Um, we do it together. Mm-hmm. Um, at, at the end of the day, I guess I would say, even though I mean, he's going to hear it, but I don't listen because I'm not telling the truth, but I am. <laughs> um, at the end of the day, <laughs> at the end of the day, he has the final, you know, final say. Right. Um, but we do talk about it a lot of stuff together. Um, because he don't think the same way I think. I don't think the same way he thinks. So if we bring that together, we might make a good decision. But with that, <laughs> we had to, we <laughs> but with that, we had to learn how to be honest. You right. know, because sometimes I'd be like, oh, yeah, that's cool. And then I don't really think it's cool. But now we got a bad. Now we, you know what I'm saying? So that part is together. Um, kids, hmm, that's, a, that's a mixture. I mean, we, as far as kids, what we talking about, like taking care of them or discipline or all together? Whatever. Who, who does the discipline? Me. Mm. I do. Um, I might not follow through on my threats, most of my threats, <laughs> but I do majority of the discipline. Um, taking care of them, like as far as clothes buying, all that kind of stuff is definitely me, which I would rather because I want my kids <laughs> to match. Um, and let's see, that was how many I did for her. Mm-hmm. So one more. Cleaning. Mm. Guess we'll do that one. Maintenance, uh, upkeep of the house. Um, it's mainly... It's both of us, really, but I just go behind him and redo. You know, he helped me out, and mm-hmm. I just go behind him and just kind of, you know, this go here, that go there. Mm-hmm. But thank you, though. <laughs> like that kind of I stuff. I appreciate your effort. Mm-hmm. Right. <laughs> hey, but ooh. He's trying. Right. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's, and that's why I can appreciate it. So that's what's going on now. I'll come back to what I was. What you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so fond of you. Because you had what? think time, see? No, I didn't. Okay. No, just, it's just, I mean, maybe because I'm in a relationship, so that's how I was so mm-hmm. easy for me. <laughs> I didn't take that um, in shade. I didn't either. Did you do that? <laughs> the only thing I did was laugh. I can't laugh. <laughs> for my top five, <clears throat> Um, my first one, I... I want um, the I want him to be submiss- submissive to God, so that I can in turn be submissive to him. Um, so like that head of household thing, like I need for him to really take that seriously. Like if you gonna be the head of the household and you want me to trust you, 
you got to be talking to somebody that know what they talking about, and that's mm-hmm. Jesus. And if mm-hmm. you ain't talking to him, then no. Um, and so, yeah, so with that, then, you know, whatever final decisions – that are made. I do want us to have conversations. Mm-hmm. Um, but if we disagree, then I'll go along with um, whatever it is that he says. Um, I think I said this before, but I always have my, like my little safety net. Like if I, if you're doing something that I think that you should be doing, we're going to go ahead and do it. Okay, cool. But maybe behind your back, maybe in your face. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I'll make sure that we I'm doing something, so we good. Is he going to know about your safety net? I just said. Maybe. Or might maybe be not. in your oh. face. You know how you said you was might testing? Be, You're not no. even paying attention. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> I mean, I didn't. <laughs> might be behind your back. That's one not of the saying. two. What? You said my safety net. Is he going to know about it? Mm-hmm. And I said it might be in your face. I might be doing it, and you know about it. Or I might not. When, you, when she said safety net, you was thinking about like a little stash account somewhere. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's what I'm a, talking about. So, right. so at the beginning, you're not you're not gonna be like you know I have this right here. Oh, that yes, I'll have that at the beginning. But I'm saying like if he goes off the rails and is deciding to do something that is contrary to what it is, I think that we should be doing. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna be putting uh, some extra, extra okay. on top, and my safety net is for me. You know that what you're talking about, like mm-hmm. that I'm gonna have from the beginning. That's for me, just in oh. case something go crazy. Okay. What I'm talking about is gonna be for the household because I okay. might have to bring us back, okay. Okay. and I ain't dipping into that to bring us back. Yeah, that's, that's, that's me, me. That mine. <laughs> but y'all, are we supposed to be thinking like that, girl? Life is life, honey. Uh, you gotta live in reality. Mm. Mm. I didn't think like that, Linda. But if something do happen where it goes south, y'all just gonna have to see me on the dollar paper. <laughs> Nah, that's just gonna be it because I don't got no net. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I mean, that okay. Go ahead, finish yours, and then we go into that later. Um, but yeah, so there's that. As far as kids are concerned, I would like for it to be equal. Um, but I also un- I also understand that that just kind of depends. Like, you know, if I had the job that I have now, I'm quite sure that I would probably be pulling a lot of the weight because my job is very flexible. Mm-hmm. Um, and if I talk long term to anybody that I talk to now. No, oh, yeah. I definitely will be pulling majority of the weight. But anyway, <laughs> <laughs> I mean not because they, you know, can't, but they're in job situations where they would be able to. Um that was two. Three, as far as finances, I don't care. Like bring what you got to the table. I bring what I got to the table. I think that we should have like a joint account and then our separate accounts, a household mm-hmm. account and then, you know, whatever. Um and so everything gets pulled from there. As far as cleaning, I tell Ariel this all the time. When we get this house, some sort of maid service needs to be attached <laughs> to <laughs> the overall, like, bills that go along with everything. Budget it in. Yes. Because um, I'm okay with keep upkeep. But, you know, with the way that my lifestyle already is, and then you add some people to it, I ain't going to feel like cleaning up. Um, but I'll keep, I'll maintain Oh, what happened? What y'all did? No, we didn't do anything. Did he just had good etiquette? Oh, <laughs> y'all so silly. <laughs> and then I don't have a fifth. I can't think of a fifth. So, Didi, you go. Um. Well, for me, it's a little different. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready to hear this one. I was right. excited. I was hoping you would go after Linda. <laughs> like she said, I needed think time. It's like, no, I didn't. <laughs> um. That girl said, "Sorry, no." Don't. <laughs> That's why you got rich on your afro. Um, <laughs> Did she say rich? She yeah. just said that on the thing. You ain't got no cr- crumb like rich. She crumbs. said rich on my oh, hair. I thought she said rich too. And I'm over here looking like she got crumbs in her head. Oh, <laughs> sorry, friend. That hurt your feelings. Yes, and I'm about to look a little black. That girl talking about. I'm about to cry. I apologize. Don't cry. We talk about that later. Um, top five for me. Um. Financial, I really think that it's supposed to be equal. Mm. Um, That's nice. <laughs> I mean, if it can't be, like, as long as you, make, like Ariel said, as long as you're making an effort, then I'm okay with that. So um, if you got two million dollars in the bank and he bring 200, be like, baby, put this with my two million. <laughs> but the thing is, if no, he, no, it okay, won't so be what our he, two million. <laughs> but listen, 
for this. <laughs> but what if he Jesus bring you the 200? My, yeah, you said my 2 million. He, we collectively have 1 million 200. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, what if he bring her the two million, but then he going to school to be like a some a doctor, the so they can bring a lot of two hundred. Yeah, because he got it. You know, you can't work and be in school to be a doctor. Or, Somebody that do a lot of stuff will make money. So. Yeah, see, that's what I'm like. Like Aria said, if you're making the effort, I'm okay. But right. nine times out of ten, I'm not finna be with nobody and I have 200, I mean, two million, <laughs> and you have 200, mm, probably nine times out of ten, we, we won't even cross. walk the right. same streets. Correct. Yeah. Mm. So, where, you where, where, where am I that I attracted you? You <laughs> might fall in love with the man who cleaned your car. Excuse me? Okay. No, I ain't gonna fall oh, in love with the man that clean. Fall in love. Dang, I ain't that's gonna. A strong word. I'm not gonna fall in love with the man that cleaned my car because my girlfriend. Oh, the um, woman. I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> the way she gonna fall in love with a woman that clean her car. <laughs> um, I thought. Well, I'm in love with myself because, baby, I take. I clean my car. <laughs> I mean, I you might be speaking from personal. Yeah, you might be speaking from personal. I was just, oh, I was personal, just saying. Personal, personal. No, yeah, you try to make that personal, not. baby, for me, but that Please, ain't that's listen. you. Can we cut this off? Okay. All right, first of all, <laughs> that's can we you. go ahead with your next. Okay, <laughs> yes. Um, and I can honestly say right now, Danielle is definitely financial. Like she's the financial one. She, not that I can't do it for myself, but she wants to do it for me. Mm-hmm. You know, and I had to learn to let her because. I'm independent, and even though we're in a relationship, I, I always you. felt like I didn't need that. Like, you know, don't be sending me no money to get my nails done. What are you trying to say? I can't get my nails done, you know? Because I don't trying to say my insult. nails look bad. Yeah, because I never need for nobody to fix it. I can be like, if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't have. Mm-mm. No, that's okay. Um, kids. Wait, so when you say financial. Uh, wait, okay. Are we talking about in your relationship right now? Or are we talking about if I had me so two together, just hush. Oh, mm. well, I was asking. <laughs> we are we doing how the relationship is now? And then we'll go back to how we want. Okay, to um, kids, we don't have any. Don't want any. Thank <laughs> you. Next, she point. doesn't want any either. <laughs> yeah. Um, have you even asked that? Yeah. Oh. Okay, so she wanted kids. It flips back and forth for her. Like I'm a strong no. Like, no, there is <laughs> exclamation point. All capital letters, underline, underline, underline. You have more kids than any of us. The devil is a liar. Um, She wants kids sometimes. But, like, that, that one weekend we had went to the beach and we was on, like, teenager duty? Uh, No. After that, she was like, well, babe, you know, after this weekend, I realized <laughs> taking care of kids takes a lot. Like, they literally have to go everywhere you go. Mm-hmm. Exactly. <laughs> so, that's... True? That's a kind of a iffy situation. I'm a hard no, still. I mean, if she has kids, she will have to take care of them. Um, yeah, I say if she has kids, <laughs> yeah, like you would be part of the equation at all. No. How would that work, Dee Dee? And ignore a child. These are, who? Who? These your kids? Oh, Lord. whatever they need, you better get it for them. They hungry. Hold on, let me call your mama. You are not gonna do the that. crazy thing though is Dee Dee is actually good with kids. Yeah, they don't listen to me though. I mean, I no, they, know. they they don't, but they don't. But <laughs> they don't. <laughs> you're still good with them. I'd be like, I'm gonna beat you. They'd be like, No, you're not. Okay, I don't know. Shut how up, you know. Shit, <laughs> that, oh, oh, oh. Mm, I was going in and out, y'all. Um, that weekend that you're talking about, uh, the kids wanted to be with you. Yeah, those teenagers, like they were cool. like, we're riding with Dee Dee. Yeah, mm-hmm. like, even though okay. I tried to tell them no, but it's mm-hmm. okay. See, that's the kind of stuff I'll do. I'll be like, You, you want to be the, sure the cool you, auntie? You sure? Yeah, let me stay the cool aunt. <laughs> That's key word. Return them back. <laughs> okay, return to Cinder when you're done. Um, what else? You got financials. House. You talk about kids, household chores. Oh, oh um, cleaning your mind. Cleaning up. Now, we both about the same. Um, yeah. When it, especially when it comes to cleanliness, it's real particular. Um, yeah. Like if you're gonna clean the toilet, I need for you to clean the toilet with this, not that. Um, I need for you to vacuum, but I need for you to vacuum all the same way. So all the lines, yeah, both of us are like that. So, do y'all have like specific things that y'all clean? Mm, no, I know that she don't like doing dishes, so I'll do the dishes, so she won't have to. Mm. Oh yeah, we compromise. I like that because right. mm-hmm. I don't mm-hmm. like dishes either. But I wash and fold the clothes. Well, I fold them, so we have to compromise on. Yeah, that. see, she'll wash them and I'll fold them because it's the washing for me. Really. Yeah, I wash clothes all day. Folding is that me? folding <laughs> stuff lower? Well, I mean, they might not get folded the same day, but they'll get folded <clears throat> eventually. Mm. 
Okay. That's so easy to say for two, one, two people. Yeah. But child, first off, I be struggling with this one person. Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. No kids. We won't have four. four it's ooh, just two. That's for sure. Her and I. Four pants, four <laughs> underwear, four everything. Times. Child. <laughs> Five. And see, for, well, I got about four because y'all know I take showers and change clothes a lot. And for me, when I change clothes, like if I put on the outfit, mm, no, I don't like that. Four I times put, a day? I put it back in the dirty clothes. I mean, put it in the dirty clothes, not back in. Cause it Even if you just change it out and you ain't went nowhere, you just change your mind. Yeah, because it's easier to put it in the dirty clothes than it is to Hang put it, it back. back yeah. Hmm. <laughs> That's interesting. <laughs> no, ma'am. I'm going to flap that thing up. Oh, right. You think I hang it up inside out? I'm going to flap it out and put it back on the hanger. Or I might just put it on my bed and be like, okay, I hang that up when I get back. New. <laughs> um, but okay, so Linda, you were asking a question about something. Nessie. Or what was yeah, it? Your nest. Your net. Your oh, your yeah. Nest. My safety net. Should we have one? Yes. Um, because, you know. Or should we think like that or something you said? No, I'm not saying don't have one. But why wouldn't you let him know? Oh, I didn't say I wouldn't let him know. I, w- I might not let him know about the safety net that I'm building for the family for this stupid decision that we all got to go along with because he the head of the household and he made the final decision. Mm-hmm. So, to, you know, make sure his ego okay. And, you know, I ain't, you know, stomping on nothing. Mm-hmm. So make him like- feel like the man. Uh, I might not say, oh, yeah, I'm going to do this while you're doing that. Mm-hmm. Just to like keep undermining. Like, right. you don't really trust them. Yeah. Even and so you don't trust exactly. me. I'm not saying, but, do. <laughs> but I mean, then when it blows up, I still wouldn't say like, okay, that's why I was doing this over here. Mm-hmm. Like I still would just kind of ease it on, you know, mm-hmm. what, and it might not even be financial. Like, it could be a lot of different things, but mm-hmm. I might just, you know, kind of little by little do whatever it is that we got to do to, to get us back to wherever it is that we need to be. Like a simple example, you know, he told me he's going to grill out and she know he can't cook on the grill. Oh. So she going to be in the kitchen cooking something else. So when the food burn mm. up on the grill. And, and nobody, don't have, so nobody don't have nothing to eat. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Y'all hungry. And Looking at this food. And she's like, I'll, I'll, cook the, I'll cook the size. You cook the meat, baby. <laughs> and the whole they time. say, you know, we done got chicken. Yeah. We done got, the whole right. time we got food on the inside. Why exactly. you done burn up our food? Yep. Uh, that makes sense. I like yeah. that idea. Okay. So, I mean, it's, you know, men's egos are a little fragile. So a little. You got to protect them. It's kind of hard for my situation, though, to do that net thing mm. um, because we literally started together from nothing right. pretty much. So yeah. that's why I mm-hmm. guess the net part um, and then even going into the separate accounts part mm. really doesn't affect me kind of. I don't. I mean, because we literally had nothing together, right? So if we would have came together, oh, you here go your two hundred dollars and here go my two million, then you know, okay, then I would have had let's have a joint account and mm. then we'll have separates like mm-hmm. that right there. But it's it's all together for me and that's fine. It's funny because um, uh, my mom and our dad, <clears throat> they um, all of his money went into the joint account, and she had he told her to have a separate account. Like he mm-hmm. actually told her have a separate account. Um, And she took care of the groceries and like buying our clothes and stuff like that out of her money. And Mm -hmm. he took care of everything else. Mm -hmm. Um, That's what I'm looking for. <laughs> right then. Uh, so bring, you know, bring him to me, Dad. Bring him to and, me. And he told her he was like, you know, at, you should have a safety net. Like right. you should have something, um, just in case you know something goes down or whatever. And so it was not. It wasn't a secret from from him. That's understandable. It sounds nice, you know. Mm-hmm. And maybe one day we'll both get, you know, we'll get it together. But right now, all of the money that we bring in is going towards something. I mean, we do have something left over at the end, but, you know, it's we need all of it together. Right. Mm-hmm. But we'll get there one day, though. Boo-boo. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I know there are some couples that be like, well, you pay the mortgage and I'll pay the light bill, you know. I just feel like and they they don't they don't have like roommates. they don't have like yeah. a joint account. <laughs> Everything is do. <laughs> yeah. You saying so they, so they just, don't they yeah. don't they don't have a joint account. They have their own separate right. personal accounts. Yeah. And whatever I pay is what I pay, and yeah. don't ask me what I have oh, at the yeah. end. Mm-hmm. Well, or what why. if it say, "Can I borrow twenty dollars from my husband?" Like, how can I ask my husband, "Can I borrow twenty dollars?" Oh no, it don't me, be borrow. No, let that's me what, tell. But people say that. Can you? Can I borrow twenty dollars? And I pay you back. Like that's what I'm saying. How can I ask my husband to borrow twenty dollars? Oh, baby, I done spent twenty dollars. And like just just like that. Well, I talked to a man, and he was telling me how he wanted his household to run, and he was like that there'll be a joint. All the money will go into a joint account, but then we'll have an allowance, like two hundred dollars a week. 
And so he come in. So what if I spend all my two hundred dollars in two days? You would spend two hundred dollars a week. I'm just making Jesus. a. I'm just. I mean, you know, it's just an example. And he was like, "Well, of course, you know, you can go get it because you know it's your money too." And he said, "But if this happens often, you know, we don't have to talk about you know like." Do we need to up your allowance? Because I, that's what I have. I don't. Why would I have to come to you to ask for my money? My mm-hmm. money that I made. That's but he said it, it. It has to be an open communication. Like anything that's spent outside of your allowance, that's something we got to talk about. And see, for me, I think it would be <clears throat> anything that's spent over a certain amount of money. Yes, mm-hmm. I agree with that one. Um. Like, you know, because I do not need you calling me that to, to tell me that you spent $10 every time you spend $10. Like, mm-hmm. okay, go spend your $10. Mm-hmm. But if we get 75, 100, 2, 3 on up day, I'm going to need you let me know, like, you know, what what you're spending, it's, especially if it's the household money. Mm-hmm. And then we also have to kind of. Cause I, I think like whenever I think about it, we were all we were both kind of agree on a certain amount that we would put toward put in the joint account mm-hmm. based off of what it is that we bring home. Now, of course, we would have to you know figure out how much our bills amount to so that we can make sure that we always have the right amount. Um, but if you know you spend ten dollars out of the joint account for I don't know what reason you would have to do that, but <laughs> whatever reason, you don't have to let me know that. You only had your joint account card and you needed a burger. Okay. Boom. <laughs> um, you, you don't have to let me know that unless we down to our last $10 or something, which I don't think, I don't, I ain't foreseeing that being the case. Mm-hmm. Um, but if you decide that you want a 65-inch TV. <laughs> now then we need to talk. We need to have a conversation. Y'all remember when Martin did it on, 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 <laughs> on the Martin show? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were struggling for that. <laughs> I was struggling. I don't I don't know. about the Tahashi or something. What? Mm, I just <laughs> what? The Taihashi. That was the name of the brand or something. It was something oh. similar to that. Hitachi. Uh, Hashi Tashi. That was two thousand. That, that, was ma- that girl said Tashi Hashi. <laughs> 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 oh, mm, oh Lord. Mm. Yeah. I, and I can't even imagine like you pay the water bill, I pay the light bill. You pay the rent, I pay the car note. You pay the car. Who keeping up with all of that? Not me. I would, and for me, knowing my husband, I would rather <laughs> be responsible <laughs> for, paying for paying everything. You pay the rent this month? I don't know. Did huh? I? Look, no, we don't got time for that. Let me just go. I know I, I everything. I think so, sweetie. <laughs> no, girl, you ain't got to pay my man. <laughs> he ain't that country now. Yes, he is. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but I would not want to even give him that that responsibility. responsibility. No, mm-hmm. I just would rather. I know when everything is due, and it's just easier for me to go ahead. But then I saw this show, or I don't know if it was a show or something, and the I get once something happened to the to the wife, and the man was lost. Mm-hmm. He didn't know the passwords mm-hmm. or anything. He didn't know anything. He was just lost. Mm-hmm. I saw the flip side too. Yeah, like and how yeah. was how how was he supposed to find? So sometimes I feel like that I should you know give him. I don't want to say give him a responsibility, but you know <laughs> let him take something to be responsible for, and not even necessarily take it anything, but you know write it down someplace and let him know. Okay, yeah. this is where this is. So just in case something happens to me, you know what to do. And you know how to access. All right, you can log in to pay the light bill. <laughs> or, not, or not only that, whenever it have bill night, and be like, "Come on, let's pay bills," and then y'all go through the process what? together. Girl, yeah. bills is di- bills first of all times. on this busy schedule. We gonna have a bill night. <laughs> first of all, you can make it a thing. Let, let, that sounded you. good. Yeah, in in, your, in your head, be yeah, right. Because we are gonna have I a know. bill night on the first, on the twelfth, eleven. I was the just 13th. saying, like to get him in the habit of doing it. That's okay. that's what I was saying. Even okay. if it's on the first, I mean, you know, come on, let's pay the rent. This is what you do. And, and some of that stuff I don't learn. It's I. Put it automatic. I was scared of automatic draft at one point, but now I put stuff on automatic draft. Oh yeah, so I could remember because then I'd be the one forgetting to pay something because I don't got everything else to pay. So, mm-hmm. and I mean, I don't personally see anything wrong with some one sole person being responsible for paying, you know, for paying the bills, getting mm-hmm. the bills paid. Right. Um. You know, just make sure, like I, like we said, like your significant other knows 
the information mm-hmm. to get in. Um, <laughs> right. So that, you know, they won't be lost. Forgot password, <laughs> forgot <Right>. username. <laughs> they Everything. just basically have to start over with life. <laughs> um, Having a call to like, can we transfer these lights? <laughs> I don't remember my password to get into my account. Right. Yeah, now that might be a little bit much. Especially the phone bill. You know you have to have that phone password. Ooh, yeah. mm-hmm. Child, I don't be knowing it myself and I pay the dog on things. <laughs> yeah, and I'm the account holder. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> look, here we go. Y'all look, can't give me no hint. Look, <laughs> Diddy, what's your four digit pen? I made a four digit pen. <laughs> oh, me. Is it, me. Hear me go. Is it letters or numbers? <laughs> y'all don't have no alternative. What else can right. I tell y'all? My social right. I know that. I know that. I'll be quick right. to say, can I just tell y'all my social? I know that. <laughs> and they would not. They like, your four digit pen where I can't access your. Now, y'all know y'all got more ways to access right. my account. Just go ahead and, and send I know because I used to work at ATT, so I know mm-hmm. that you could do that. Mm-hmm. Just send me this temporary because I don't know what it is, ma'am right. and sirs. Um, but yeah, that's, I don't know. Uh, financials is always, oh, I, I know, I had a question. So, what, so, okay. We are not living in a perfect world where mm-hmm. whenever you come into the marriage, you don't have nothing but whatever it is y'all got together. Mm-hmm. What happens for the things that are your thing? Like, for example, I have student loans. Oh. Well, um, f- uh, first of all, when you get married, they go together. I'm about to say they go in the bill account. Oh, they okay. come out the no, joint I'm account. talking about, oh, you're talking about paying them. Right. Yeah. Oh, right. well, then y'all gonna, gonna have to come out the joint account because when you get married, they come together. Right, mm-hmm. I didn't know. Me that. and Vons is together. Like mm-hmm. when you go on Navy and all y'all are like, yeah, it, and oh, wow. but yeah, it, literally ours is together. Wow, I and we know that. and even ours is now with the same Lord, loan servicer. My husband will be mad at me. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I didn't yeah. even know that was a thing <laughs> until like whenever COVID started and we had to log in to do some little some little something, mm-hmm. and it had all of our stuff all together in that total Jesus Christ. <laughs> but um, I didn't even. I was like, "Why is your name on here with my stuff?" Because when I think whenever you get behind or something like that or something mm-hmm. happened, I don't mm-hmm. know. And they do whatever the little what they take it out. What's that called? Where they take it out without what is it called? Um, forbearance. Or no. Deferment. Where they take it out. It's not neither oh, one what? of them. What's she taking out? Garnish. Garnish. Yeah. They garnish yeah. Oh, girl, I ain't got that. When, yeah, we didn't get that far. We had stopped it before it got that far. But I think that's when everything had, oh. you know, came together. I'm like, nah, I ain't had this much. I ain't been to school that much. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot. But yeah, I, mm, I, to me, that would come out the joint. But I mean, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I, don't have I, feel, joint, so I, I feel like I if know. you accumulated, you ain't. Right. I ain't responsible for that. And I mean, and it, it, to me, it depends on how much it is, mm. because it's very easy to say, you know, a hundred something dollars. All right, yeah, cool. I I'll, I'll cover that with you or help you or whatever. But you bringing like three, four, five, six, ten thousand dollars, you know, a, a month or whatever it is that we know. How does it work mm-hmm. when you paying back? They give you like a number you're supposed to pay back. Because mm-hmm. honey, I do the five dollar. Yeah, they give you um so <laughs> they take into consideration a whole lot of different things. Um mine is a mortgage paper. Yeah. A mortgage? And then um oh my based God. off of those considerations, they'll give you a number. Mine has changed several times. It'd be over. a lot, a lot of dollars. Like was Lana started, say a mortgage? Uh at one point in time I was paying like four hundred something dollars a month. Woo fuss. Woo. Yeah, I mean you they ain't you ain't had no other option. <laughs> <laughs> Right, a five dollar with your option. Yeah, because they would have said four hundred from. Excuse me, man. Well, they would have probably said hello, for you. hello. I mm. think my phone is being hacked. Hello. Then it's based garnished. off of your. It's based off your income and all that kind of stuff. No. Um. So based off of my income at that time, even though they go based off a of gross, right? Um, and not what I actually bring home. Okay, so boo boos. Like what I what my my gross is and what I bring home is not the same thing. So if y'all out there listening for the student loan folks, can you please help? Right, because you out? know you see them taxes being deducted. Exactly. That so means how did you survive? It. You couldn't even get you no burger when you were hungry. You had to go home <laughs> well, and cook. Four hundred dollars. Well, we Just will thank God bill. for my mom. Oh, mm-hmm. we thank you Mr. Um, because she did split it with me, and she in. Because a part of my student loan, I think we don't paid it off now, though. But a part of my student loan, I actually took out took out during undergrad, and she told me that she would help me pay that back. Um, and so I think that was during that time. So mm. we split it. Oh, um, so lovely. Yeah, it, it was, it was still, you know, it was still a lot though. It didn't work. Um, but now, uh, when I start paying again, I hadn't started back from COVID. Um, it'll be like one, 
So I need to go ahead before oh. they try to get and, my taxes. And see, then that for us, mm-hmm. it's different because we have children. So oh, that yeah. was one of the things they asked. So I didn't even know they could even. I didn't know it could be that high because they always ask us, do we want to do the $5 yeah. thing? Cause and, our and that's the thing. If I had kids, mm-hmm. I could do the $5. Even with my, the, what I bring home and all that kind of yeah. stuff, I still could do the $5. Oh, that's and why. How they going to know if I got kids? I can and just tell them I'm taking care. Roles. I can tell them about, um, I'm taking care of somebody else's kids. Well, they asked why I see. We had to turn <laughs> You can. Stuff. If you are, like, it only have to be kids. Like, if you have people that you are. Oh, I'll tell them I take care of my mom. Yeah. Yeah. Um, oh, so she if y'all listening don't listen no more because right she ain't gonna do that for real but yeah <laughs> but, but i do take care of my mama you do going back to the, the to the general roles thing i don't know like i think that would for me if you're bringing in outside stuff it would kind of depend on the dollar amount mm. i ain't saying i wouldn't help you but well now that y'all done told me it'd be that much i have to rethink i thought we were talking about a little five dollars <laughs> <laughs> let come out the joint <laughs> little five dollars ain't nothing wrong with that little ten. five dollars <laughs> that 10 with both of us come on i mean and not even just student loans like you know people have just debt in general that yeah. they bring into relationships Damn. um and you know like i want to help you because i i want us to be able to get a house i hate to have to get a house and you just have to move in <laughs> But look, you just be on the um, <laughs> on the D. <deed. laughs> I mean, but I will. Um, but yeah, so dang, I ain't. Mm. There's so much to think about, right? Mm. Mm. But let's you think me and think about this stuff. Yes, especially financial wise. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was a, that helps build and tear down the ego. That's one of the biggest things I would think. No, no, I'm talking about. Do you think they sit around and say, "Well, I know what the gender roles are going to be"? That's what I'm saying. Oh. oh no, they probably have that. what they want. Like I know I want my woman to do X, Y, and Z. It may not be as detailed as we have it, but they have their ideas of their do's mm-hmm. and don'ts though. Yeah, but then they have their ideas of do's and don'ts from how they were raised. raised. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And I had to break that down. You were raised great. I love the way that you were raised. But listen, let's do it this way. <laughs> we're gonna have to like this let's is a partnership. This. Right. Mm-hmm. Like I'm not gonna work all day and you come home to, you know, and, and a full plate. And people on the social media will make a, a wife feel horrible mm-hmm. that she doesn't mm-hmm. work all day, take care of the kids all day and don't have a enormous plate of a high cholesterol sitting on the table. <laughs> Not like, like you know, I seen question, that so much now, though. My for question real. is, but did you eat? I mean, right, <laughs> whether it was a dollar burger or no, whether it say, was fried chicken. What you said my day was, you ain't said what I had to do on my day. You just said you wanted me yeah, fed. Like that, and it's really been aggravating me how people be trashing parents and wives and stuff that do not bring a plate home. Mm-hmm. Like this is how you keep your man How? Because I gave him high cholesterol mm-hmm. You know he might I mean <laughs> Yeah you keep him all right Yeah <laughs> I mean I think that should be split too Like yeah. Because just as well as I'm working I mean just as well as you're working I am too You mm-hmm. tired? Me too boo boo mm-hmm. Right And don't get it twisted that Just because I'm working from home That I don't get tired right. Right. Or I work at a salon Right Because I, I, I do stuff. I feel like work <laughs> is work And a lot of people <clears throat> Have that misconstrued That like For me I'm dog tired all the time because now one job I don't really too much do nothing, but doing nothing gets tired. Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. mm-hmm. that's then, worse than doing. Stuff. Yeah, and then mm-hmm. my other job be tearing me in every direction. So you know what I'm saying? I still, I mean, would make the effort. You know, if I could, if I had mm-hmm. the energy, mm-hmm. you know, or even bring home something from your job. Like oh, you can, yeah. it's a lot. Of, you better be glad I ain't got no kids because I'd be in there just like the rest of them packing up a bag. Like, that's mm-hmm. My kids got to eat now. I need some chicken tendies. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure I get that honey mustard right there. Give me that honey mustard. <laughs> yeah, right. some salads and stuff like that. Yeah. But I don't, I don't, yeah, that cooking thing for me, it, it has to be split. Right. Or you're going to have to be okay with eating takeout. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or even if it's not work, 90% school. of the time. Like right now, I'm in school during the week mm-hmm. and I work on the weekends. Like just because I'm sitting in class don't mean, you know. School is a lot of work. It, it, mm-hmm. I have learned that. Mm-hmm. It takes a lot of <laughs> mental. Just because you're not physically doing it. Right. Your mental will be. You be oof, a lot. Because you always be thinking about, Lord, did I do that? Right. Mm-hmm. Did I do that? Mm-hmm. What, what time and then if you take it more than one class at like, it's. On top of children, on top of you know that's on top that's of working. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. that is a lie. But I am definitely grateful that Vaughn stepped in on my gender roles. <laughs> so okay, well that leads me to another question. And um, ha- have gen- our gender roles like etched in stone? No, no not for no. us. No. They definitely switch. not. Off. No. Oh, they definitely they sweet. They they sweet. But are there are there gender roles that are no matter what like? 
no matter what the situation, <clears throat> this is how it's going to be. Not for me. I think the only one for me that'll be kind of halfway sketched in stone, but not all the way deep, it'll be... Um, Trish. <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the final decision type thing. Mm. Like, you know, making the, the final decision. Um, but we still got to communicate before and effectively, honestly, communicate. Right. I think that one is that one pretty much stands because it's been working for us for you know for a, mm-hmm. a, a couple of months. So <laughs> that, that, takes, that takes so much trust, uh-huh. and I think that's where you know I am with the whole submission thing and stuff like that. You know, I've been doing this thing by myself for a long time, and call I on just, me, call on me, Peronda. <laughs> Yeah, because did, I mean, did because, you say something? <laughs> yeah, I had said Ferranda. I, I had called him Ferranda because it, it's so contradictory. It is like because what you first, what you started off saying mm-hmm. was, I've been doing this by myself for so long, and I'm tired of doing it by myself. I want somebody who's gonna do it. Like, but just do scary. it. Just take it off my, take it off my hand. But then I can't trust you. It is scary. But then, you know, I just, have to trust you. I gotta be able to trust you in order to be able to submit to you because I just don't be trusting. So I mean, like, what you want, boo? Mm-hmm. What you want mm. for real? I mean, I want to trust him, but I'm just saying that is a lot of trust. That's scary to me. But I guess what I, and I'm saying, you know, you might you present that to whoever your significant other is going to be for the rest of y'all's life. And he hears that and he's like, OK, I got you. And then y'all get into the relationship and you you pulling and tugging. Anytime he's trying to do exactly what it you is think that I'll you... be pulling Trump? Girl. Yes. Girl. 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 Yes. 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 <laughs> you didn't know what to say. Girl, I was like, it's crazy because she, she was finna <laughs> She was finna say not in a relationship, right. but she had to change. I'm not Mary. in a relationship. I, I mean, oh, here we go. I'm you not. might not be today, <clears throat> tomorrow. Yesterday. Mm. I mean, I'm talking about yesterday and the day before that, oh, last yeah. week and last month. I think you were no, but anyway, that's mm. another conversation for another day. Right? <laughs> okay, um, and it could be a whole episode. <laughs> Or five. <laughs> oh. And we can do a little short series. Oh, uh, wait. Can you just go ahead and make your point? I did. Oh. I said, and, and Didi exclamated my point. I don't even know if exclamated is the word, but it sounds good. Exclamated my point with a cuss word. Oh. And so, yes, we're saying that you would do that. Right. So, you got work to do by yourself right now. You got to learn that's how what to. I'm, that's what I'm. I got a lot of work to do. But for me, making the, like, the decision, well, giving, trusting him is because we're on the same page. But mm-hmm. like, if I say like, okay, let's use for Fer- Rhonda's example. If she, <clears throat> if she doesn't really agree with what he's going to do, but she's going to let him make the final decision. Cause that happened like, for y'all. Yeah. It's happened a couple of times actually. And it was big but, stuff. But it was me. It I blame me though. But some of it is because I wasn't honest. Mm-hmm. I've lied and said, okay, yeah, let's do that. That's awesome. <laughs> And you know, yeah, and it wasn't like I. And deep down inside, I was like, "No, my God, I don't want to do this." You know, but I didn't want (laughs) to. But I didn't want to. Like that's how I was feeling. Like I, I don't really, I don't think this is a good idea. We don't really. That's why I said when I made that statement, it's been working for us for the past couple of months Mm -hmm. because it literally has. Mm -hmm. Because I know now, in order for us not to go back to those situations, I got to be honest. Mm -hmm. Because he only going off of what I say. But if I say no. What about this, this, and this? Mm. And he'd be like, oh, yeah, you know what? Right. So what about this, this, and this? Like, now we're coming together, and now we're mm-hmm. making progress, and we might make a great decision this time. Mm-hmm. Like, that's just how, that's just how. So for me, it's not, it's hard now because I know that I'm being honest, and I know if I do not agree with something, he going to know. Say that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, if it, it, like, I, I think now that it is. So what if you do not agree, and you communicate that you do not agree and he is like, but I think this is a good move. Mm-hmm. Has that happened? I'm um, not in the past two months or three months. <laughs> okay, so let's think. Hmm, if that was to happen, well, seeing that I don't have a net, <laughs> the bottom of the net. About, <laughs> I ain't talking about no net, though. I'm just saying, like, I don't what know. Would, I have no idea. Approached it at. 
I, I, I would just stress it so hard. Like, sweetie, I really don't think we mm-hmm. should do this. Just you know, go to speak and, and think about still, it. Like <laughs> if mm-hmm. he stills like, yeah, I really think I'm going to roll with this. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Do you get do. eventually get on board, though? I don't know. We haven't gotten to that. I mean, before, you know, I would lie right. until I got on board, but... <laughs> I, just, I feel like right it should be now, like a like if we do this, I'm gonna go ahead and let you know. If we fail, first thing gonna come out of my mouth is I told you. No, so. I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna say <laughs> that. <laughs> let us know why. I'm not gonna if say that. If I tell that you now. from the beginning, look, I don't think this but right. He but he would already do it. know that I right. wouldn't tear him. I wouldn't do that to him now. Because mm. that, I mean, he, that's gonna just make him feel ten times worse. Because yeah, my wife told that. me, I already have in my head. Yeah. My wife told me not to do this, and then she comes and said, "Well, I, I told, told you not." No. Just gotta remind you, just so we know next. <laughs> he time. already know though. I wouldn't do that. That's now. why y'all have grown a whole lot more than me. <laughs> but even before you had to think about it, that way, that his feelings are already at I the mean, bottom. I don't tell him that day. No, Girl, no, no, no. So when you gonna tell him? Like, but this is why I said that you. No, 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 no. We'll just have to. I, we would just have to figure out how to come up from it is what I could think oh, about that see, I could say a, right now. That's right. a good answer. But I'm just, I'm literally that's going off of what wife. I would think. Like if I had to choose right now, I'd be like, okay, so we, and when I mean immediately after it falls through, what are we about to do? Right. How are we going to come back from this? Mm-hmm. Because now we have nothing, you know, or whatever mm-hmm. the case is, whatever. And even I if think you like that the wrong could branch. potentially be a part of the conversation too of, okay, so you already know that this is not something I'm 100% on board with. So I need a contingency plan. Mm-hmm. So just in case things go south, what are we going to do? And I'm talking about I need it up front. Mm-hmm. I need an A and a B. And, and I might C. need a C, B, and E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, S, Y, and a C. All of them. All, All of them. them. Like, because like, I, mean, I, need be like, like, I don't even want to do this no more. Right. There you go. Come Point on. proven. Because I mean, I need you to think about it from all mm-hmm. the different case scenarios. Just mm-hmm. in case this thing goes south, think about it from here, 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 and all the other here's. Mm-hmm. Um, and what have if a he plan does that, that to you? I mean, okay. That's fine. I, first of all, I would already had it planned right. out, anyways. Mm-hmm. And see, for, yeah, you come with a backup plan just in case yeah. this don't yeah. work. We can go ahead and do that's, this too. That's how I do life in general, though. Mm-hmm. And my thing would be okay. So if this fail. Then my next thing that you don't agree with, you better get on board <laughs> and quick. <laughs> and don't even, I don't want you to mumble or stump your toe. You better just be ready. Raise that eyebrow. <laughs> you know. Because <laughs> I was here. I ain't going to say but it again. Y'all should just play rock, paper, scissors, sorry. That's no, a, but you know what we do, 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 DD? Over simple things, not as big as <laughs> <laughs> You know, we flip a coin. I just mm-hmm. learned how to flip a coin, actually, oh, because okay. I usually let him do it, but now I think he be cheating or something, so I had to learn okay. how to flip a coin. Me and Danielle like do rock, paper, scissors, best two out of three. I'm horrible at it. I'd rather rely on the coin. Mm-hmm. I do rock all the time. Mm-hmm. See? Exactly. It's easy to cheat in that. No, no, no. It's no. not all. You can't. You no. Know, because nah. paper will always be Oh, rock. paper be rock. Mm-hmm. I don't even mm-hmm. know how to play, I guess. Nah. I'd rather you know, flip. You know, when you're playing with Linda, I always choose paper. Because <laughs> you're going to always <laughs> win. Come on, Linda. Huh? You're going to pay my car note. One. One, two, three. Ha! <laughs> but it's really a mind thing though because i tell Danielle, i don't know it's just like from playing with people the first thing that they always choose is rock mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. nope see i rather rely on the coin it's always two sides yep <laughs> um i think it's interesting too how gender roles have progressed mm-hmm. um mm-hmm. over Thank the God. years i mean because <laughs> what we're talking about now even when I have conversations with my mom about how she handled her first and her second marriage, it was, it's nothing like mm-hmm. what it is that we're talking about now. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, she did everything. At all. Uh, but they they handled everything financially. Yeah, yeah but she did and, everything else. And they did exactly, well, I know for a fact the first marriage, kind of maybe the second one too, um, they held things over her head. Oh. Like, because mm-hmm. I'm taking care of things financially, you have to do what it is and so you have less of a say in the final or in the decision making because I'm at the end of the day the one putting up the money mm-hmm. and I don't care if you are putting up the money mm-hmm. we still mm-hmm. gonna have this conversation mm-hmm. oh, yeah. <laughs> you said what <laughs> you gonna choke <laughs> yeah, yeah no mm-mm. that's mm-mm. I made that very clear at the beginning like listen this is a partnership. Mm-hmm. I am not about to sit up here and work my tail off and do everything while you sit back, kick your feet up, and watch mm-hmm. TV. Mm. No, we not about to do that. These both our kids. Both of us made these kids. You gonna help me even if it's clipping toenails? You gonna do something <laughs> to help me with these kids? Gonna contribute? Yeah, it's like way. no, I can't. I'm, yeah, it's different times. Definitely, and that's fine with me. 
Yeah, because back in the day, I feel like, and another thing, back in the day, they they were complete. Like, they, they did what was they thought was necessary mm-hmm. or like, you know, they stayed together because they thought that's what they had. You no. Know, yeah. We're more vocal. We're yeah. more, yeah. more to do. vocal mm-hmm. about I mean, what we want to do. And you think about the jobs that were available to women and even less for black women. Yeah. Um, so they had no choice to you know, yeah, they, they had to be dependent on the man. They had mm-hmm. to be at home making them homemade biscuits. They high <laughs> cholesterol. High cholesterol. <laughs> diabetes. <laughs> because that's all they had to do. So you better have my homemade biscuits ready mm-hmm. when you get home. Because that's all mm-hmm. you could do is be at home. Well, mm-hmm. now I got a lot more to do. <laughs> Child, first off, um, I stay at home. Like whenever I get uh my god kids or whatever, man, my hat go off to stay at home moms. I mm-hmm. would rather go to work. Yep. And take you to somebody else. Break. Yeah, right. Break. Like, that is who child. Like, don't we got daycares? Or those stay at home moms that take their children to daycare. Oh, you know, people be, <laughs> be me. People be yeah. like, why she dropping her child off at daycare? And she don't got no job. Yep. Mm. Mm. What time y'all stay the latest I could pick up my child at 6 o'clock? I'll be here at 5 But you know, they, they done changed some of them laws. You know, DSS can get called if you leave your child over daycare for a certain amount of hours. Oh. Mm hmm. That was it. When we was in Greenville, you cannot leave them. I can't remember the hour number. And it was like a stupid number. Like, if you work a 9 to 5, you got to show that you work a 9 to 5 in order for them not to call DSS on you. Dumb. Yeah. For real. And I would tell that DSS case worker, <laughs> you know what? I can be here for five hours. Okay, well, then you get the other three. Yeah, like, it was like a stupid number. Like, how in the world? I work a 9 to 5, and then we in Greenville. I got to drive all the way across this traffic to get to pick my kid up. Mm. And you're going to tell me I can't leave my, you know, kid... And then they, they open at what? Seven o'clock. Mm. Like, that's crazy. Mm. I took them so out that day. Well, he actually got kicked out of daycare. But either way, you know. <laughs> either way, like it go. <laughs> it ain't like how I used to be. I drop you off when they open and I'll be back when they close. Mm, from not seven no to more, seven. Honey. You day from seven to seven. You got a whole 12 hour job mm-hmm. at the daycare. Okay. Help, help yeah. this lady pick up her stuff now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I mean, because I'm going to have to pay you the same amount whether I keep them there for two hours or uh, right, the whole time. Right. Or if it's they show up at all. That's what I ain't got to pay for that slot. Mm-hmm. Sure do. So, yeah, you going to earn your keep around here, honey. Mm-hmm. I gotta pay you. Yeah. So I'm sure one of them moms. I'm off during the week, but guess what? Them kids go to school. Virtual who? Mm-hmm. <laughs> In person. And I tell people all the time, like it, parents weren't trained to be teachers. Y'all yeah. be like, mm-hmm. oh yeah, just mm-mm, that that you weren't trained to do that. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Nope. Mm-hmm. I can teach you how to tie your shoe, use the bathroom. Like, mm-hmm. I can teach you those things. But when we try my one plus one is two, I don't know about that. <laughs> Yep. So gender roles. So I, I mean, what I basically heard was partnership. Yep. Mm-hmm. It might be partnership. Partnerships might look a little different for each person, but mm-hmm. at the end of the day, it's a partnership. Mm-hmm. Everybody was one non-negotiable for your gender role. It could be something that you have to do or your significant other have to do. One. Mm. Non-negotiable. You got to. Mm. Okay. I gotta thank myself. Dang, I gotta see we, only one though. Just Can we one. get two? No, no one. one. Dang, I can't. Get, I look, give me a. Oh, what about one of each? No, what? Uh-huh. One no. thing he gotta do. One thing one. I gotta do. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I really can't think. There is nothing that's that's mm. non-negotiable. Negotiable. I think my only non-negotiable for real is uh, that you you seeking some guidance from God. As long as you doing all the rest of that, then we can negotiate everything else. To that. Mm. Can't negotiate on. Mm. That's mine. Well, in that case, it's all ours. Yeah. Because I was about to say, I don't think I have one. What about other than that? That's a given for us. (laughs) So think of another one. (laughs) Yeah, that's a given for us. So what's another one? Um, (laughs) How y'all gonna change the rules up on my? (laughs) (laughs) Why I say there's none because I I want us to always be evolving and you know. I just don't want to put a. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> so, so if he decides that he want to have a conversation about putting gas in your car every week, yeah, and yeah. he wants you to do it for both of y'all cars, Duh. then we have to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> and I would have to do some persuading, mm-hmm. right? So no, that's not like a non-negotiable. Not negotiable. <laughs> my, my, I don't want to say that sounds so. To be a non-negotiable, you talking about Jesus, and I'm talking about gas. But I say that, that was, was a given yeah, for all of us. But I'm just saying that just else. seems so minor compared to like. I don't to, know. Oh, I mean, you know it's minor I mean. in comparison, but. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I don't have one. 
I would yeah. say have to be not the gas. I mean, because I will stop to the gas station. Mm-hmm. Mine would be. Oh, yeah, five, I will five, put five. five. Um, Aggravating. Look, to get enough to get to you so you can finish the race. <laughs> right. But mine would have to be folding clothes. That's you doing it or me okay. doing it? Uh-huh. Yes. Because I'm very, you know, especially if I have a different drawer space or whatever. But anyway, <gasps> like I'm very OCD. particular how the clothes are folded. Like, don't just roll it up and throw it in the thing. <laughs> well, I am. Just roll it up. No, no. Like, all of my leggings are rolled up neatly. His joggers are rolled up neatly. Like, I have, it has to be some kind of order. Um. Well, then that kind of depends for me on the person that I end up marrying. Because I am very particular about how I want things to be cleaned and how I want things to be put away as far as clothes and stuff are concerned. And even how the bed is made. Mm-hmm. Um. So if he come correct and his mama taught him how to do stuff correctly mm. according to my standards, <laughs> then you got some high well, that's it. I was like, that's away, but I mean, then okay, we cool. But if not, then you know, because even with the maid service, I'm still probably gonna go behind him because I'm still gonna be maintaining. Yeah. Um, mm. you just gonna do all the hard like scrubbing and getting on the flow and doing stuff. My baseboard. Well, <laughs> whereas I'll sweep and <laughs> just right. fan. wash the dishes and, and dust. Um, so yeah, that would be my non-negotiable if he ain't coming correct. Mm, I like that putting up the clothes one because I'm tired of Lena having my clothes and me having Lena clothes. The child. <laughs> First off, I don't even understand that. Yeah. But that's a conversation <laughs> for another day, I guess. So you don't have one, Didi? Or you can't think of one? I don't have one. There's nothing that's like non-negotiable. Like no, I can't do that. Yeah. Well, mm. huh? mm. gender roles. Gender mm. roles. Gender roles. Okay. Oh. oh. You oh. better sing, gender girl. Rules. Oh. Well. <laughs> <laughs> that is it rather you deeply. Do it. <laughs> um, <laughs> how many of us have them? Rose. Yeah. Oh, the what kind? Mm, I got. It. Let me see. <laughs> um, <laughs> never mind. I don't let Willa. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> what part about it are we talking about? Right. Nick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. Oops. Thank y'all so much for joining <laughs> us on this episode of the Perfect DD. Just yawn, girl. Just yawn. <laughs> she was doing good. <laughs> Just yawn, honey. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> <laughs> um, thank y'all so much for joining us on this episode of the Perfect People Podcast. This and is your girl Feranda. This is Dee Dee. <laughs> this is Ariel, aka Ari. This is OG. We'll see y'all next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>